A few years back, my father and I had an appointment with a renowned cardiologist in my hometown. Dad, otherwise, is a hale and hearty person, and one doesn't expect uh, your father to ever fall sick. I mean, he's the uh, the hero of your life, so to speak. But then, as things would have it, uh, he had a cardiac ailment, and the good doctor advised him to undergo an interventional procedure. In spite of me being his son and a doctor, I had uh, butterflies in my stomach when the doctor made this announcement. And then on the announced date, we went to the hospital. It was a public uh, hospital in those days. It was many years back. And I still remember uh, following the protocols. In that specific public hospital, there are no visitors allowed. So they, in fact, instructed us that at a designated date and time, you could come and see uh, your loved one in the hospital. They were very clear about their protocols. I also remember uh, before the procedure, the consent process where the doctor had come and uh, given an informed consent. And I'm repeating this that I was already a doctor, but in spite of that, the way informed consent was given, it was uh, quite, uh, honestly, it was quite frightening, but the doctor had to do his job of uh, covering all those risks. And then, uh, yes, the procedure went off very well. Uh, Dad is quite fine and uh, we were all quite happy about it. But what I really appreciated of that government hospital is the way protocols has been absorbed by each and every staff, whether it's the security at the entrance of the hospital, uh, the administrative staff in the, in the billing counter, the nurse, and of course the doctor. It was like uh, a certain culture uh, permeated across the hospital. And today uh, we are of course in a private sector. We are one of the leading private hospitals in our country as to India, so to speak. And uh, what I want to talk about is the quality week, which is being celebrated on 14th. It should not be uh, specified or specific to one day or a week, but it's rather a 24 by seven, 365 day uh, kind of a culture which we need to create where all of us come together and ensure that anyone who encounters providers either on a telephone or an email or actually visits our hospital never has a moment of disappointment, whether in terms of their service expectations, their clinical outcomes, that is what this quality week is all about. That how do we do simple things right without making mistakes that could in some way cause harm to the patient who has trusted us uh, with their own uh, bodies to come and uh, seek care from us, our systems across India. So that is this a moment for us to pause and reflect back on the basics, go back to your protocols, your uh, habits of doing things right. So Quality Week will uh, touch upon all these uh, topics. And I also would like to emphasize that Quality Week is not an activity done only by that department, which could have few professional colleagues in them, but all of us across a hospital or clinic or wherever we are, we are all passionate quality members and we need to walk the talk, so to speak. So I wish you all the best, soak in this moment, experience a quality in its true sense and let's live up to our motto of we'll treat you well. Thank you.